Get us back to the hub. Jack, what are you doing? Resisting the urge to shoot. Tosh, get everything from the weapons room fast as you can. It's locked down. There's no manual override. Just open the store on your knees. Hands above your head. Jack, for God's sake, what are you doing? Tosh, I gave you an order. Gwen, help her. Did you know that thing was down there? I put her there. You hid a Cyberman within Torchwood? And you didn't tell us? What else are you keeping from us? Like you care. I clear up your shit. No questions asked, and that's the way you like it. When did you last ask me anything about my life? Her name's Lisa. She's my girlfriend. Why didn't you tell us we could have helped you? Torchwood exists to destroy alien threats. Why will I tell you about her? A little loyalty, perhaps. My loyalty's to her. She worked for Torchwood. She was caught up in battle. I owe it to Lisa. We owe it to her. To find a cure. Now, do you have to believe me? There is no cure. There never will be. Those who are converted stay that way. Your girlfriend will not be the exception. You can't know that for sure. Look, you need to know what's happening here. Because this is where these things start. Small decisions that become mass slaughter. These creatures regain a foothold by exploiting human weakness. Then they take a base, rebuild their forces, and before you know it, the cyber race is spreading out across the universe, erasing worlds, assimilating populations. All because of the tiny beginnings here. We need to stop her. Together. You're not listening to me. The conversion was never completed. She already tried to kill Gwen. You think she's gonna stop there? There is no turning back for her now. I'm not giving up on her. I love her. Can you understand that, Jack? Haven't you ever loved anyone? You need to figure out whose side you're on here. Because if you don't know, you're not gonna make it out of this alive. You have to let Diane go. Like I did with Lisa. Don't compare yourself to me. You're just a T-boy. I'm much more than that. Jack needs me. In your dreams, Yanto. Your sad wet dreams when you're his part-time shag, maybe. That rift took my lover. I'm not captain. So if I die, I'm trying to beat it, then it will all be in the line of duty. I don't know what you've done. No, I can't just hook something up. The entire telephone network is down. What about mobile connection? The entire telephone network is down. Mobiles, landlines, tin cans with bits of string, everything. Absolutely everything. No phones, phones all broken. Hello? Anyone there? No, because the phones aren't working. What's that? CB radio. They knocked out the phones, but they can't knock out the radio waves. Not yet, anyway. What about we try? There is no way of getting in touch with Jack. No way. Tosh, Owen, can you hear me? Jack! Thank God. What happened? There's a cell. It's active. Four, including Beth, who are dead. We're tracking the last guy now. If we can get them before he does anything, we can stop this. What can I do? He's heading for an abandoned farm just outside the city. I need to know what's out there. Where the hell is he going? There's nothing there. Nothing on the surface. 
He's nearly there. We need to hurry. Yeah, hurrying, thank you. What happens when it starts first? How do you get in the heavy weapons? I don't know. Um, I think we just have this arm stuff. So how do you manage to take over so quickly? I don't know. I didn't even know how to use this thing until today. This is as far back as they go. There used to be a coal mine in the cliff. The army sealed it off in the 40s. It doesn't say why. Let me see if I can get into the military files. Well, guys, that wasn't even difficult. You disappoint me. It's almost obscene way to do the security system. Oh, God. What is it? The mine shaft. The military are using it for storage. Nuclear warheads. Ten of them. Nobody's supposed to know. Not even us. That's how it starts. No heavy weapons. Exactly. They don't need any. They use our own against us. We left the key under the doormat. All you need is to walk in and take over. Please tell me you can stop this. Going as fast as we can. If we don't, we won't feel a thing. We're all at the center of the blast radius. That's comforting. Come on! Have a little faith with a dashing hero like me on the case. How can we fail? He is dashing. You have to give him that. And what if they can't stop it? They'll stop it. Yeah, but if they can't, then it's all over. Let's all have sex. And I thought the end of the world couldn't get any worse. Our memories define us. Adam changed those memories, changed who we are. Now I have to help you all go back. Find a memory that defines you. We discover who you are. If I'm wrong, you'll still be here when we've done this. Let me take you back to before we all met. Feel around for anything that makes you what you are. The hidden and the forgotten. Tell me where you are. In the college canteen, Reese is sitting opposite me telling stupid jokes. Where do you find a tortoise with no legs? Where you left it. <laughs> <laughs> it's my birthday. I'm ten. Mum spends the whole day screaming. And I love you because you're my son. But that doesn't mean I have to like you. Maths club. Something so reliable about maths. Always the right answer. Meeting Lisa. Falling in love. Never felt so alive. Turn 16. She packs me back. That is the nicest thing you've done for me in years, Mother. Kissing him in the supermarket. The look on his face. My first flat. I don't have a flat warming. There's no one I want to invite. Losing Lisa. Like a world had ended. The way he looks at me sometimes. As if he's scared of what he feels for me. I, I love him. But not in the way I love you. Take this. Knowing there has to be more to life than this. Knowing I'm special. Waiting for someone to see it. I saw it. And you save one life. Hundred lives, but it's, it's never enough. Who will save me? I will. Coming here it gave me meaning again. You. You each have a short-term amnesia pill. It'll make you forget Adam. We have to wipe out the last 48 hours from our memories. Go back to who we were. Uh. Okay, this has to stop. No, listen to me. I don't have time for this. Look, 
I don't care what your problem is. I want you out of the city by sunrise. There is no place for you here. Go back to London, find yourself another life. Keep stalking me, I'll wipe your memory. No, but the thing is... Look, any conversation between us, no matter what the subject, is over, finished, done, forever. I'm getting back behind the wheel of that car. If you're still standing in the road, I'm gonna drive through you. So you're not gonna help me catch this pterodactyl then? Okay, that is the only special equipment you've got. Yeah, because I keep dinosaur nuts in the back of the SUV. Well, Torture Lennon would have. Nope. How'd you find it? Rift activity locator. Torture London. See? Quality kit. Yeah, it's quite excitable. <sighs> Must be aftershave. Never wear any. You smell like that naturally. 51st century pheromones. <sighs> People have no idea. Ready for another go? I'm game if you are. Three, two, one. <laughs> Can't stay here. Come back with me. I've got somewhere nice and big where you can fly around. Okay, so you have a pterodactyl in it, not me. You need a guard dog. I could be that. Like a receptionist. Building maintenance. Food and drink. Dry cleaning even. That coat of yours must take a battering. Like a butler, I could be a butler. We don't need a butler. Well, excuse me. Try to your collar. That was a busy week. What exactly is your plan? I'm gonna be the decoy. And it will rip you to shreds. Dinosaurs? <laughs> Had them for breakfast. Had to. The only source of pre-killed food protein after the asteroid crashed. Long story. Here you go. One injection to the central nervous cortex. Occupant occupied. Move. No. What? Knows me. I'll be a better decoy. You're way too dangerous. No, I've got a secret weapon. Chocolate. Preferably dark. Uh, good for your serotonin levels. If you got the serotonin levels. Hey, report for work first thing tomorrow. Like the suit, by the way. You must be in trouble. Was it Christmas? Are they? Yeah, it was a bit of a scare. I brought him home just in case. But I reckon it's that group hysteria thing, like when lots of girls all faint at the same time. You say thanks to your uncle? I did. David, your uncle Yanto's here. I was thinking I missed Misha's birthday. Thought I could take it to McDonald's or something. That's all the 3 95 you big spender. All right, cinema. Yeah, that'd be nice. You'd like that, wouldn't you, Misha? Thought maybe this afternoon. No chance. What about Saturday? I'm kind of busy on Saturday. You're a civil servant. They don't work weekends. They invented weekends. And I'm not having a going out. Not today. Not with all that voice thing. I want him where I can see him. She'll be with me. She's staying put. Right, fine. Just an idea. I won't bother you. Well, that's it, is it? Who's going to go now? Oh, sit down, you daft sod. 
I got some of that spinach dip. And you and me, well, <clears throat> we got things to talk about. What things? You've been seen. There was a Holly Tree Lodge just outside Arbroath. It's a hotel now, but up until 1965, it was a state-run orphanage. And they had a Clement McDonald. He was taken into care April 1965 after his mother died. No father on record. Five to control. Harkness now approaching door one. Over. He's inside. We don't know how deep that place goes. Give it five. Over. We need damage control at St. Helens. One body, Dr. Rupesh Patanjali, shot in the back. What happened? I don't know. He was just left there right beside me, like someone's gloating. Did they kill you? Yeah. Maybe we're being targeted. Whether it's him or me, we should be careful. Better tell Gwen. She's back. She's in the lab. Gwen? Boy, have I had a day. Oh my God, is that? How long? Three weeks. That's good, isn't it? From where I'm standing, it looks good to me. Yeah. Yeah. It's brilliant. Janto, we're having a baby. You told Reese? I only just found out myself. Oh, you told me before you told him. He is going to love that. <gasps> Congratulations. <laughs> Wouldn't that be a good time to tell you I lost the car? You did what? That is just bloody spectacular. What, what about this place and um, my job? We'll manage. We always do. There's that. Oh my god. It's a bomb. There's a bomb that's on your stomach. Get out! No. Both of you! No! Right now! Last radio is one more out! Right now! Get out! There'll be something we can do! No! We can stop it! We can fix this, okay? We can rip it out of you! I'm telling you, get out! It's active two minutes! You will like, just run! You're pregnant. We are coming. John! We are coming. John! We are coming. 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 Lockdown. you're gonna get locked inside. Yanto and you! You're waiting to override the mechanism! For God's sake, get out! There'll be nothing left of you! I can survive anything! Ah. Torchwood, knock down. Torchwood, knock down. I'll come back. I always do. Stop it, Stephen! Stop it! We are coming. Stop it! We are coming. Stop it! We are coming. We are coming. We are coming. Yeah. I wasn't followed. Sit down. You worked on my little code then. Seriously, how'd you get in that state? A bomb. It was meant for me and the people I work with. My God, why? I don't know. What sort of civil servant are you? Unappreciated ones. Are they okay? 
people you work with? I don't know. Gwen's alive. I just know we've contacted that. I'm not sure about Jack. Is he your boss? The one Susan told me? He'll be okay. Don't get rid of him that easy. We just need to find him. If it's a boy, mm. Edward. Edward? Yeah. Mm. After the king. <laughs> <laughs> Problem. Cooper and Jones stalled us at a roadblock. How did that happen? I'm sorry. There's a chopper on the way, but they've got a head start on us now. If he talks, we're in deep, deep shit. I'll have to call him back. Where the hell are you taking us, Yanto? What are we doing? You'll see in a moment. Get the car started. We've only got a few minutes. Come on.
told you I'd be back. With no help from us. What the hell's going on? Don't know yet. But the latest from the kids is that it's happening tomorrow. I'm just in time then. Get in the car. Come on, we've got work to do. Frobisher's the key to this. He's just a civil servant. He's nothing. What makes him start authorizing executions? What did it feel like? I mean, getting blown up. Wasn't the best of days. No. But... Did you feel it? Or did everything just go black? I felt it. Shit. Yeah. Do you ever think that one day your luck will run out? That you won't come back? I'm a fixed point in time and space. That's what the doctor says. I think that means it's forever. So one day you'll see me die of old age and just keep going. Yeah. We better make the most of it then. Suppose. Like right now? Yanto, the world could be ending. The world's always ending. And I have missed that coat. Reese, do you want to take the car and go to those shops uh, down by the wharf? We need some discs for these things. Should take about 20 minutes. 30 minutes. 30. I'll, I'll go later. Um, the beans are almost done. The beans are almost done. Buddy beans. Get out. It's all my fault. No, it's not. Don't speak, save your breath. I love you. Don't. Yato. Yato. Yato, stay with me. Yato, stay with me, please. Stay with me, stay with me, please. It was good, yeah. Yeah. Don't forget me. Never good. I was in your time. You will remember. I promise, I will.
Don't leave me, please. Please don't. You will die. And tomorrow your people 